हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू रिंकूज रसोई आई एम शेयरिंग अ वेरी पॉपुलर स्नैक एंड दैट इज चक्री बट द यूनिकनेस ऑफ दिस चक्री इज इट इज़ नॉट फ्राइड आई एम गोइंग टू शो यू हाउ यू कैन मेक बेक चक्री सो आई एम मेकिंग टू वर्जन ऑफ दिस बेक चक्री आई एम गोइंग टू बेक इन एयर फ्रायर एंड एज वेल एज आई एम ऑल्सो गोइंग टू बेक इन अवन सो यू कैन चूज बिटवीन दोज टू मैथड्स मेक द चक्री फर्स्ट इन दिस बॉल आई एम गोइंग टू एड वन एंड हाफ कप ऑफ राइस फ्लावर इन दिस राइस फ्लावर आई एम गोइंग टू एड हाफ कप ऑफ व्हीट फ्लावर सम पीपल ऑल्सो लाइक टू एड बेसन फ्लावर बट आई एम एडिंग व्हीट फ्लावर सो नाउ आई एम गोइंग टू एड सम स्पाइसिस इन इट सो फॉर द स्पाइसिस फर्स्ट आई एम गोइंग टू एड वन टी स्पून ऑफ रेड चिली पाउडर हाफ टी स्पून ऑफ टर्मरिक पाउडर वन फोर टी स्पून ऑफ हिंग असफटीरा फोर टेबल स्पून ऑफ सेसमे सीड वन टेबल स्पून ऑफ जिंजर एंड ग्रीन चिली सो आई एम जस्ट गोइंग टू एड इट ओवर हियर ना आई एम गोइंग टू मिक्स एवरीथिंग टूगेदर जस्ट रफली मिक्स इट सो नाउ वी आर मेकिंग बेक चकली Sometimes the baked chakri it feels so hard to chew. So for the softness, I am going to add half cup of yogurt. And 4 tablespoon of oil. Now again mix everything together. Make sure that everything is nicely mixed. Now I'm going to use my hand to mix everything together. So just mix with your hand. So as you can see, everything is mixed. Now, last but not least, I'm going to add some salt in it. So I'm going to add almost a tablespoon of salt. Quantity of salt is depends upon your taste. So now I'm going to mix it again. Now I'm going to add little bit of water to make a dough. So just add little bit water at a time. and keep mixing so here everything has been nicely mixed now i'm going to cover this So now I'm going to let it sit aside for at least 20 to 30 minutes. So while I'm waiting for this, I'm going to prepare my chakri maker. So here I have my seal maker. I took the attachment for the chakri. It's like this. It's the star attachment. So I'm, so I'm just going to put it inside, and I'm going to grease all the sides. So here I'm going to grease this with oil. I'm going to grease everything. so the dough will not stick inside so just grease it very well so my chakri maker is ready so now as you know we are going to bake the chakri so in this baking tray i, uh, I just put a silicon mat if you do not have silicon mat you can also use parchment paper and for the pre preparation i already put my oven on 360 degree fahrenheit and that is 180 degree centigrade so here it's been 20 minutes so i'm going to open this and this one is nicely done now i'm going to take little bit of dough and i'm going to add this dough in my chakri maker i'm going to add some more dough and just close the chakri maker now 
Now I'm going to start making the chakri. So in this tray, I'm going to make the chakri. Just make a round and then last one, just put it like this. Same thing, just repeat the process for all the chakris. So here I have my chakri ready. First I am going to put it in oven for 15 minutes. Then I am going to flip it and I am going to bake it again for 50 minutes. So total is 30 minutes. So while my chakri is getting baked in oven, let me show you how you can make this in air fryer as well. And in air fryer it is a very quick process because instead of 30 minutes you can prepare it in just 10 minutes. So here is the uh, plate from the air fryer to make it crispier. So if your air, air fryer has this plate, I would recommend to use this plate so I'm just making chakri here and sometimes I'm having question that the chakri is not exactly round so some people have difficulty to make it perfect round so let me give you some tips for that always keep your chakri maker a little bit higher so you can see the flow and you can control the movement so it just like this and take it little bit higher and then you can just make sure that it's round see now it's very easy that you can see the strand and you can place it wherever you want to place it so just and take this the last strand and just stick it here like this so that's how you can make perfect round So now I'm going to put this plate into the air fryer and I'm going to fry this for 4 minutes on one side then I'm going to flip it and I'm going to fry again for 4 minutes. So here I'm just going to put this inside and now I'm going to fry this into the air fryer. So here this is out from the fryer and as you can see the chakri is nicely done and let me show you. See it's so crispy. And it tastes amazing it's soft as well so that's how you can make chakri in air fryer as well and this this is done in eight minutes so i put it for four minutes i flip it and again i put it for four minutes and once the air fryer is hot so next batch you can put it for less time so make sure to keep an eye on it and sometimes it takes like seven to eight minutes and sometimes it takes like five to six minutes and here this is out from the oven and as you can see it's nice crispy and it's cooked very nice look at this and it tastes amazing and the best part is you can eat as many as you want because there is no oil involved and it's not fried so it's very healthy this is the perfect snacks so so make this at your home and i'll see you next time with the new episode of rinku's rasoi till then happy cooking